Now, what's the best way to move around a big spreadsheet? If your worksheet contains lots of rows and columns, you'll be spending a lot of time moving around the spreadsheet using the mouse. Now, every mouse scroll will only move five to 10 rows of the spreadsheet. So imagine you have, uh, have 1,000 rows. How long is it going to take you to scroll down to the end? Now, what if you have 10,000 rows? What about 100,000 rows? Now, if you want to move around a spreadsheet quickly, you should be using the keyboard instead of the mouse because using the keyboard allows you to move precisely to the last row and instantly. Now, if it works, it works up, down, left, and right. Now, the key is to use the control key and the arrow key. So watch this. Now, if you have a, a big spreadsheet like this one and you keep scrolling down, it's going to take you a long time. So the best way to do this is to use the control and arrow key. Now, you have to first click onto the cell here. Now, press the control and the down arrow key will bring you down right to the end. All right, now, too fast because it's a big spreadsheet. Okay, let me share with you how it works on a small range. Okay. Now, how we move around is to click first the cell A2, press the control key and the down arrow key, and it will bring you down to the last row. Now, you can also move to the right, move up, move to the left, and instantly you will move uh, to the other four corners of the spreadsheet. So it works for a small range. And now let's go back to the big range here and it works for the big range too. So control down, control, control to the right, control up, and control left. So that's how you can navigate around a spreadsheet instantly. Now, uh, when you actually combine the control arrow key with the shift key, all right, this is the effect that you'll get. Select A2 here, control shift and the down arrow key, and you see that it will highlight the whole range instantly. Okay, now if you want to move it row by row, you use the shift key and the arrow key and you move down one cell by one cell. So suppose that uh, I want to create a sum formula now and I have a huge range, right? So how do I create this uh, instantly, right? So I can use equals to sum, open a bracket here, I click onto the last cell here because that's where I want to start. Press the control and shift plus the up arrow key. It will bring me all the way up to the top row. Now, I do not want to include the header, so I will use the shift and the down arrow key to exclude the header. Now, close the bracket here and enter, and I'll be instantly able to create the sum formula over here within seconds. If you like this tip, remember to like the comment so that uh, the next time when you come to YouTube, you can see my new videos as, uh, as I add more videos to my channel. Hope to see you again next time.